So just after racing, that thunderstorm kept on growing and, um, and unfortunately the boat was struck by lightning a couple of miles from the course. Um, very thankfully everyone on board the boat was okay, but you know, I guess since then we've realised that the damage to Amakura is, um, is pretty significant. Pretty quickly, we, you know, we realised that all of the electronics on board were, were fried. Uh, a lot of the hydraulic components, um, you know, especially the titanium parts, you could see where the, where the current had been through, there was sort of scouring on them. And then over the coming days in Singapore, you know, more and more things started to crop up. Um, that's when the decision was made to, to bring Amakura uh, back to Aotearoa. Amakura is now all packed up into containers as it normally would after an event, except this time some components are going to Sydney and the main structure of the boat, the hull, is coming back here to New Zealand. So the reason to bring it back here is because we have the facilities and the resources to do the, the investigation that we need to do. In the marine industry, boats do get struck by lightning regularly, but not a boat as complex and advanced as this one, so we're a little bit unsure what testing we should be doing. We know we definitely need to put it under structural load testing, which is a test we do for every new boat. We're going to do some thermal imaging, and we're going to do some tap testing and some core testing. So a relatively compressed schedule to do all of this, to do a full electronic refit, a hydraulic refit, all new componentry and parts, and get it down to Littleton ready for sailing. That's one of the cool things about SailGP is that the boats, when you're lining up there, you know you're racing against a boat that's um, you know, exactly the same as yours. We have in the past, um, in some training days, sailed some other teams' boats. It has, it's been a little while since we've done that, but um, yeah, you, you can hardly notice a difference apart from um, some of the visual references.